Turning now to a place in London where plants, paper and punctuality feature heavily. An Art Deco building in Kensington has been transformed into a showcase of Japanese culture and it opens tomorrow. Wendy Hurrell has the story. Once you enter the door to Japan House London, you will be breathing Japanese air. It's a culture familiar to us in the foliage or food. And then there's the famed punctuality. Our interview with the Japanese ambassador was scheduled for 9.16 sharp. This is a hub of culture and of course uh, through London we can reach out to the world. The opening exhibition in the space downstairs is called Futures of the Future and displays Japanese creativity. The shop shows their innovation. I think what Japan is really famous for is its ingenuity and finding really good solutions. So something as witty as a stand-up ladle. Everything in this room is made of paper and even these slippers are made of paper. And so it's this idea that there is beauty in the functional, there is ingenuity, attention to detail and precision. There are Japanese influences all over London, like here at Holland Park. The country has also had an effect on our eating habits. Across the UK, there are now more than 900 Japanese shops and restaurants. There are a thousand Japanese companies based here, an investment of 60 billion pounds. And in London alone, that accounts for more than 35,000 jobs. And it's done in collaboration with Yamaha. In central London, 70% of this design company's trade is with Japan. Our Keech Design Tokyo office is, is opening basically this week. Japanese industry is always looking outward and looking at you know, what's next. And the technology is constantly on the move. And so I think for us to be aligned with that is, is, is very good. The new Japan house on Kensington High Street will be a focal point for London looking out east. Wendy Hurrell, BBC London News.